I want to direct your attention uh, back to uh, 2021, um, where you were approached um, by uh, the district attorney of Fulton County, uh, Fonnie Willis, um, about being a special prosecutor. I was. Uh, I don't do. You, I don't recall the exact date, but uh, I know it was sometime uh, in 2021. And uh, she asked me to come down, and uh, I met with her and Nathan Wade, and there were several other in the meeting. Uh, she asked me, uh, said they were beginning this investigation, and she asked me if I'd be interested in being special prosecutor, to which I replied that I had mouths to feed at a law office and uh, that I could not, I would not do that. And I know you said you hadn't met him uh, until uh, 2023, but when you were living at um, Miss Willis's house in Fulton County, uh, did you ever meet Mr. Wade in uh, the year 2019? Absolutely not. How about in the year 2020? Absolutely not. Did you ever see Mr. Wade at Miss uh, Willis's uh, Fulton County house in the year two, uh, 2021? Never. And is it your testimony that the <laughs> only time or the first time uh, that you met Mr. Wade was in uh, 2023? Let me say something. Mr. Wade said that he remembers seeing me, and I do remember some banter. I'm a member of Kappa Alpha Psi fraternity, and there's kind of this thing that goes on between fraternities. And Mr. Wade is a member of Alpha Phi Alpha, and they, you know, so they, I do remember there was some kind of banter when my daughter was sworn in to be district attorney between me and a couple of guys, and he said he remembers me. I don't remember him. And um, prior to uh, that experience that you're talking about, uh, as well as, uh, I guess, your official meeting in 2023, had you ever even heard his name? No, never. For example, I had three safes in my house. Uh, I put some of my clients' stuff there, too, uh, things I didn't want other lawyers to be, I mean, because you're always in a firm, and I knew that there were special conditions, so some of my clients' things I would bring home, put them in the safe, but I've always kept safes, and as a matter of fact, I gave my daughter uh, her first cash box and told her, always keep some cash.